Okay, I know I've done a couple of these, but uh, I just wanna, I just wanna show you real quick. So this is a stock VKS with a quad drill, oh, which I hate. All right, so flip your side up. Once all four of the screws are out, this is how hard it is to remove the factory. Pull back, oh, sorry. Forgot to do something because I ain't used to these crappy things on there. Take those off, that makes it much easier. Just push back and separate. Okay, now, two things. <laughs> well, first of all, one thing that's really important. Whenever you go to put one of these on, right, you with a with an AR-15, you're going to have a gas tube that runs up between these things here. So your timing, how the you know the where this is turned, is going to have to be right for the gas tube. Okay. And don't somebody tell me they don't all have gas tubes. I know, I know, I got gotcha, you, I got gotcha. you. Yes, sir. Five, five, six, love here, yes, son. All right. <clears throat> Let's see here. All right now. What you're gonna want to do? Two, th one thing you're gonna want to watch for. All right. So on these, on these uh, Magpul, these are Magpul drop-in carbine length handguards. These little tabs right here. Sometimes, when you're sandwiching these together, right? Sometimes those tabs will get stuck going past there, right? So sometimes I will actually bend those tabs just a little bit to keep them from from like sticking through these holes on the way in so very important to do make sure you want to make sure that your timing is right and the way you can tell that is start with the top right okay push this back and see these see these right here all right so it's gonna line up right or you want it to, you hope it'll line up so you can feel that it's, you know, it's going to be notches, right? So, <clears throat> I don't know how to get to where I can show you. Let's see. So, you can kind of, like when you push back in it, you can kind of tell, you know, like you can feel, right? That it, where it's going to be in one of those notches. You want to make sure it's going to be in the top, right? And you can feel it like this, right? Okay, so right there, I've got it. I've got it like in a notch enough to where. Well, I moved it out. See, so you need to make sure that it's going to line up because without that gas tube, these are not necessarily going to line. Okay, there you go. Here's where this one would be. See that? And if that's the case, let's make sure, if that's the case, then you would have a really hard time getting this to work right. So, all right. <clears throat> Once you do determine if it's lined up or not, here's what you do. I'll tell you another way to tell. If you can, if you can eyeball it, what you're trying to do, what you're making sure, here we go. It's going to be a little offside, but let's see, let's go this way. All right, so what you're making sure is that one of the valleys, see those little things right there? All right, so the valley of one of those needs to be in line with the valley of that okay if that is not a straight inline shot right there then you need to take your tool and you need to tighten or loosen just a smidge to get it top dead center now so looking at this one 
looking at this one head on, it looks like that it actually, it doesn't, from, from the camera, it looks like it's off because the camera's on the, you know, side of the, uh, side of the phone or whatever. Maybe you can tell there. But anyway, so it's pretty much lined up. Okay. So once you've determined it's pretty much lined up or that it is lined up. All right. Get your top piece. Okay. Flip your sight and put that inside that. That is actually your delta ring, even though it's not a delta ring now. <laughs> they used to be triangle shaped is why they were called delta rings. But... Okay. Now, you wanna make sure that that is actually in there, that it's actually all the way in there, okay? Now, <clears throat> Pull this back as a whole and push that down. See that? Okay. Smack it a little if you want to. Pull it back as a as a whole unit. Okay, and that's how that's the trick right there. Kind of pulling it all back together. See what I'm doing? Because it's gonna be like that, right? So pull it all back together, okay? Now, so wiggle, you know, weasel these up where those tabs do not get stuck in there, all right? And your little piece goes in there like you can tell it's supposed to. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Like that. See what I'm doing? Pull this puppy down. There you go. <laughs> Usually when I smack them, they go in, but nonetheless, there you go. Magpul handguard so. Now, if you want to put a power barrel in it instead of that one. Done deal. Four inches shorter. More accuracy, more power. Boom, 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 boom.